So do you suffer from clog pores and feel like you've tried everything and tried every product out there? If so, if that's you, I want you to keep watching this video because I'm going to share with you a step-by-step -step guide on how to unclog your pores and have fresh, healthy skin because uh, it's everything, okay? It's everything, so keep watching. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to steam your face at home to unclog your pores with a simple at-home beauty trick. Don't go nowhere if you like this type of video, these types of video, then keep watching. But before I get started, hey, welcome back to SBE Aesthetics. I'm your licensed esthetician, professional makeup artist, and here on this channel, I cover topics about being an esthetician, entrepreneur, skincare and beauty enthusiast, which benefits you to become a better you, you guys. Okay, so we're gonna be going over, I wanna say there is eight steps uh in this process to unclog your pores some of them uh, may be optional but i would advise you to follow through with all the steps in the order that i give you for the best results you guys so be sure to follow through and i'm actually going to be doing some things in real time so i want you guys to really see the benefits of uh steaming your face at home okay you guys so we are about to start the process as far as what steps to take to unclog your pores i hope you're ready like i am because your girl need her pores cleansed i usually would do it with my facial steamer but as y'all know i'm new to georgia so i'm currently uh, looking for a place at the moment so I say why not take at home skincare regimens. I could be sharing with you guys what you could be doing at home versus going to a spa. So it's a win-win you guys. So I'm going to be, you can also steam your face at home. You don't actually need a facial steamer. And I want to share with you how to do that on a budget. So step one, you want to cleanse your skin with a cleanser of your choice for your skin type. Then wipe it off. So cleanser I'm going to be using today is going to be the Ormetic Balancing Gel Cleanser. This one is very uh, balancing, neutralizing. It's kind of great for all skin types, you guys. So this is going to be more of your natural line from Image Skincare. Still professional product, but more gentle on the skin. So I'm going to go ahead. I have my towel. So I'm going to go ahead cleanse my face <clears throat> all right get my face all you know lathered with water i guess i shouldn't be like covering my eyes because um <laughs> i gotta see <laughs> and this is what it looked like it's pretty clear and then you just rub it Oh, this feels so good. Oh my goodness. Yes. I'm too excited right now. So this is really good to exfoliate. This right here would be considered a very mild exfoliation because it's just a cleanser. It's going to help remove the dirt and everything off your skin. So you want to be able to keep your skin before you steam your face you want to steam on clean skin why well you don't want extra dirt on your face right <laughs> and it just helps open up your pores even more once your skin is already clean see look at that and so I'm just gonna do the we're gonna take it off I'm gonna do a, a double cleanse. Just one more, doesn't hurt. Wanna make sure we get everything. You wanna make sure you get that neck. I'm gonna do a neck tutorial for you guys. Because I don't know, I have like little uh, line, like you can see little lines on my neck sometimes and it can be genetic. Um, but I'm gonna be trying some skincare products out to see if it helps reduce or soften the lines. It's no big deal, but I just wanted to make note of that, just in case there's someone who kind of got like horizontal lines on your neck. Get behind those ears, y'all. And 
and then on your ears. It's important to get. Y'all know the ears be. Y'all don't have to do all that, but I'm doing that because I, I, I want to. <laughs> so we will take the water. I got this bowl of water right here. So as you guys can see, that's the bowl of water. And I'm going to dress myself even more. I'm going to pet. Oh my gosh, y'all. Yes. Get that stuff off of there. Okay, so I'm going to dump this water out and we're going to move on with step two. Okay, guys, so for step two, you want to boil some water in a pot. I'm going to be using this pot that I use to cook with, but you want to boil some water in a pot. You can add essential oils to like tea tree or even peppermint oil. It's totally optional. You do not need oils, but if you want a scent to help improve your skin even more, you can do so. So, but for me, I'm not going to be adding anything today. I am literally just going to, you know what? I actually do have some, um, some herbs. So I take that back. I am. I'm going to add some herbs to my uh, water to help hydrate my skin even more. So that's what I'm going to be adding to my water. I won't be adding any essential oils, but I will be adding herbs. You don't have to add anything if you don't want, but I just want to do that because the herbs that I have helps cleanse, hydrate your skin even more. So we're going to go ahead and fill this water up. Yeah. Let's, let's, let's do that. I added the boil water. I put uh, the boil water uh, in a pot and I added it in here. I'm going to let it boil up until whenever it starts boiling. And then once it stops, I'll show you guys what that looks like and what we're going to do next. So don't go anywhere. Stay tuned and keep watching. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the steaming hot water and I'm going to pour it inside this bowl right here and we're going to get started with the steaming process so just bear with me okay perfect yes you guys can see great be real careful because it's hot And that was literally enough, just enough. Okay, you guys. So before I actually sit down, I'm gonna go ahead and add this facial steam into the water. It's botanical steam herbs. It helps to cleanse, hydrate, and tone the skin. You guys probably previously saw me use this uh, when I was demonstrating on my facial steamer that I use at the spa. And so I'm going to be using it on myself. I'm only going to take a few, just about this much right here. And then I'm just going to sprinkle it in my water. Oh, you can smell it. Ooh, mm-hmm, it is, it's giving. Okay guys, so the next step, this step is completely optional. This is gonna be real. This next step is completely optional, uh, but I'm going to do it. You don't have to do this. You can actually just get started, but I am actually going to go ahead and, um, this right here. I'm actually gonna go ahead and add this mask. Usually, uh, well, not usually. <laughs> Most of the time when I do a facial on a client, I like to have them steam with the mask on to help uh, open up their pores even more with the mask. So the mask is just extra exfoliation to help open up the pores. So that's what we're going to go ahead and do. I'm going to be using this uh, mask from Image Skincare called the Max. This is really great to help improve the appearance and tightness of your skin. It's Rico fighting. It has peptides and plant stem cells to help visibly, again, smooth and refine the skin. So I'm going to use a little bit of that like that much okay and i'm just gonna rub it like that i'm gonna rub it in like that okay you guys so now it's time after you got your mask on now it's time that will be step three get yourself a body uh, body or bath towel 
And for step four, you want to hover your head over the bowl with the towel over your head like such. So it's gonna kind of be like this, but a little over like this, right? And we are going to steam here for about five to 10 minutes. And I might actually just be steaming, showing you guys for this length of time in real time because I, I just want you guys to see. So let's, let's go ahead. So we're gonna go just like this. Hi. We're gonna go like this. I am not putting my face inside the water. Please, please do not do that. I am literally hovering. This is what I look like under the towel. So you see, this is what I look like. When you put the towel over your, your face and your head and over the bowl, it just helps trap the steam. you guys look at the results you guys like look at this and it is still steaming like I mean like this is really good like my skin even my breathing feel really really good you guys like I am sweating I, I now nah, I just got my hair redone now look okay I should have covered that up but yes um, look at my skin look at my skin like this is drenched <laughs> this is not me putting my head in the water uh, my skin will burn do not do that you put your head over like this so that the steam can hit your face do not put your face in the water you will burn do not do that so uh, this is what it's looking like I don't know how long I've been under I'm gonna go under a little bit longer Okay, you guys, look how quick that is. <laughs> look, I just got saturated even more. Okay, so I wanna make note, if you feel like you're under the bowl and you feel like the steam is not hitting you good enough, just blow in the water like this. When you do that, the steam rises and hits your skin. So that's a quick tip. So we're gonna be done with this process. This was like really good, like I like it. <laughs> I low key like it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and rinse this mask off and I'll come right back to you in just a minute. Okay, you guys. So I literally just rinsed my face off and then I'm packed <laughs> drying it. I don't know how many steps. I'm not even gonna say steps anymore because I feel like I lost count. So moving on to the next step. I'm not gonna number them, okay? To the next step. Just keep in mind how I'm doing this. You do want to follow the order, more so in the skincare part, but yeah, just follow the order in general, okay? The next step, I'm going to go ahead and wipe off like you saw me do. Pat, 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 pat. <laughs> then I'm going to go ahead and uh, apply my serum, okay? So I'm gonna go in order. So keep in mind everything that I'm about to show you from now on, as far as the skincare portion part of it, I'm going to go in order. This is crucial, I believe, for you to follow these steps because you will get the most benefit, the most bang for your buck when it comes to good skincare. Now, no, it's not gonna harm your skin if you mess up on the steps. I just feel like the way how I'm organizing them step by step, I feel like you'll get the best results if you do it how I'm telling you to do it. So, okay, so moving on, the first thing we're going to go in with is Image Skincare Vital C Serum. I don't know if you guys can see this. This is like one of my favorite serums to use. It's a creamy base. Usually serums are like gel based. So I did like two or three pumps. And when you apply serum, you want to pat, pat 
the serum into your skin, right? Pat move, pat move, pat move. You don't want to rub it in like a cream because it doesn't apply it like it should when you do that. So you want to pat. This smells so good. It's very citrusy. I'll list all the products down below too for you guys. Dang, the skin is pretty much giving already. Okay. Okay. So the next step you want to do is apply an eye cream. So I'm going to be going in with the Image Skincare Ageless Total Eye Lift Cream. So I'm going to get like just a little pump. Maybe two, oops, two little pumps. And sometimes <clears throat> it has like a little hard piece in it if you have wants to dry up. So just remove that. And I like the dab. So when I do eye cream, I like to dab it on my middle finger. And then I put my middle fingers like this. And then I go like this, right underneath the eye area. I'm not going to take this eye cream up all the way around my orbital area. I'm just going to go from the crow's feet back under the eye. From the crow's feet back under the eye. I don't know why I always have my mouth open when I put on like <laughs> skincare products, but I feel like when I do that, I get like the best application ever. So forgive me if you like, see like, because it's just hard not to, okay? It's just hard not to. We got the eye cream on. Now we're going to move on to our face oil. Now, because this is during the day, I'm going to be using a SPF as a moisturizer. I'm not going to be using like a regular face cream. If it was during the night and I was doing this showing you guys, I would use a nighttime face cream or like a regular face cream. But since today, I'm going to be using a SPF. But right after the eye cream, you want to make sure you uh, apply your day moisturizer or face oil. So for me, I'm all about the glow. I'm all about the glass look skin ordeal because my skin type, I want to say, is dry normal. I feel like it's moving to the combination side sometimes. Uh, definitely, I feel like when you get older, your skin changes. And then when you move to a different state, the climate temperature changes. So yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and go in with this oil. This is Radically Rejuvenating Rose Argan Oil by Acure. So I like it, it's, it's pretty cool. I don't care for the smell, but I love the results. So I literally did two pumps and I'm gonna put that all over my face. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna put it on your lips too. All the extra product, just rub it on down your neck. Rub it on down your neck area. The last step is to apply your SPF. Why is applying your SPF the last step? Because it's supposed to protect your skin and everything else underneath it. It's the last layer, that's why. So we're gonna go ahead. This SPF is from Super Goop. Is unseen sunscreen SPF 40. I actually like it. I actually like this sunscreen. I'm very picky when it comes to sunscreens. Okay, so I got like about this much. I just dab. <clears throat> and this is very soft. Like this SPF is like super soft, which which I really love. Like it almost feel like the oil are just rubbed on me. It's just so soft. Like there's no like residue or anything. That's what I love about it because it just goes on so soft. Like it's pretty good. It really is. It's pretty, pretty darn good to me. Yes, you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed how this beautiful skin of mine came out to look, you guys. I want you to get ready and schedule a time for yourself to steam your face at home to achieve fresh, healthy skin, y'all. And please be sure to subscribe to my channel, okay? Don't forget, I'll be listing the items you need in the description to get started today. Please be sure to subscribe again and join the family for more beneficial videos for your skincare needs, y'all. Stay tuned for another video. And again, follow me on SBE Aesthetics, YouTube, Instagram, and Facebook. I'll catch you guys back with another great video. Peace.